In 2015, voters approved the Washougal School District Capital Bond to improve our local schools. By 2017, we've completed those projects on time and on budget. Our schools are safer, no longer crowded, and we've opened two new schools. We promise to improve safety by refitting the entries on all of our schools with new controlled entrances. Once a former security problem for its open design, the new Gemdegard Middle School is a secure two-story building. The new school accommodates modern technology needs, open learning spaces, and even an enclosed courtyard. The new middle school music room provides a large flexible space that can accommodate small concerts or performances. Beside the new middle school is Washougal's newest school, Columbia River Gorge Elementary. The two schools enjoy their own gyms but share resources such as the library, commons, and kitchen. As a bonus, six additional classrooms are added due to wise fiscal and construction management. The new elementary helped end overcrowding at nearby Gauze. Gauze Elementary, our population dropped from 612 students to 355, so the portables that are behind us once housed fourth and fifth grade students. Now there is no one in the portables, so that means our students are safer. Along with being more secure schools, Gauze and Hathaway Elementary School children are a lot more comfortable today because of new heating and cooling systems and new roofs paid for by the 2015 capital bond. So this is the new heating and cooling unit for the gymnasium, because the gymnasium did not have cooling in the past. Washougal Schools also welcomes the opening of the new Excelsior program. Once just portables, today it offers students a college-like atmosphere with spacious classrooms and a great room for collaboration and study. The district has a new transportation facility. The new structure is tall enough for a hydraulic lift and big enough to accommodate three buses. With the completion of the capital bond, students now have larger modern classrooms, comfortable heating and cooling, more flexibility for today's learning environments, and just more room. And each elementary school's enrollment is back below its original design capacity. The 2015 capital bond, a promise fulfilled, on time, and on budget.